devastated at the end. Obviously, you walk in after that and it feels like a defeat. I'm sure Darren's walking in frustrated. Um, maybe feels like a, a bit of a victory because they threw so much at it in the second, say the last half hour. Um, but I thought we had done enough. I thought we had done enough in the first game at Hillsborough as well, and you come back with two goals. So, um, yeah, very frustrating. But I think the players deserve a lot of credit for the amount of work rate and effort and togetherness that they showed. Um, but the disappointing side of it was when it when they went down to ten men. We didn't show enough composure on the ball, and that was frustrating. I felt, I felt we needed to keep the ball a lot better than we did, and we kept handing possession back to them, and that was frustrating. When we came in, I concentrated on getting us a lot more compact and tight, nullifying gaps and spaces. And we did it tremendously well against Preston and uh, Middlesbrough, and today we knew, we knew that Borough, with the squad of players they've got, can really, really hurt you. Um, Harvey Barnes, is it for me, is a special talent at this level. He killed us at. Uh, Hillsborough in the last five ten minutes, and we knew if we if we were to play an expansive game of football when, and then lose the ball and not react quick enough, they'd punish us. They'd get into gaps, they'd get in between the lines, and cause us issues. So that's what we've worked on the last three games. So important our our reaction when we lose the ball to one win the ball back immediately if we can't. If not, we get back into compact shape. Of a, we play a four three three, but obviously out of possession we go four one four one and tighten the gaps and, and just nullify that and try and force teams wide and deal with crosses in the box. Unfortunately, we couldn't deal with that last corner. Mm. And it's worked a treat, to be honest with you, until, until the goal tonight. Do you feel you've, you've still got a chance of the job, or what's the situation? You know what? Face, yeah, I think record's been good. The, the job will take care of itself. Um, I think I've covered it the last two or three yeah. media sessions, and uh, <coughs> I know nothing more. That's in the hands of the chairman. Just uh, plan towards Birmingham until mm. any sort of anything changes. Is that a frustration for you? Or? No, no, not at all. I've, I'm living the dream at the moment. Everybody knows my history and yeah. love for the club. So I, I'm, I'm just delighted to, to be given the opportunity for for this period as it stands at the moment, uh, and I'll prepare for Birmingham. So I don't see us frustrating in any way. No. You don't get enough time on the training ground. That would be the only disappointment because the games come thick and fast. It's more a case of recovering players and getting them patched up or uh, rested. So it'd be nice to get a little bit longer time on the training surface, but what they've put into everything we've asked them to do. And it's been great. And the lads that have been helping me, Neil Thompson stepped up from the 23s, Nicky Weaver's been great. Remy's still here from Yossi Zera. And they've all bought into what we're trying to get. And it's, it's been great support. What do you think of the sending off? Because Darren Moore said they're going to Yeah. Initially, when I saw it, I was really surprised. I mean, don't get me wrong, I did see the linesman try and get the attention of the referee straight away. But if I'm being honest, when, uh, when the challenge came in, I thought he had caught Marco. I thought it was maybe a yellow. I was really surprised when he held the red up. But obviously, the linesman's a hell of a lot closer than we are. And um, I saw something. But it was a surprise. Yeah. I've not seen it again on video, but I was surprised it was a red card. Actually, they seem to galvanise them a little yeah, bit. Well, I've just been saying that. I'd rather they stayed on the bar. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. So, so uh, I think I, I don't like talking about other clubs because that's that's not mine. But I think Dan can be pleased with the reaction of his players yeah. after that.